It's so damn loud. It is so damn loud at work. What is up, humans? It is Monday. It has been one hell of a Monday. It's driving me crazy. This Monday has been crazy. And I'm way behind on getting these videos done. I can't believe it's four o'clock. I'm trying to knock these out really, really quick. We're talking about Run the Jewels. I'm going to start with the low, and then I'll post the high tomorrow. Here is your bone or your bone box. It's the sale box. Everybody knows Nike likes the word sale. So this is your sale box. This is your stupid ring light shining on the box. But there's your details right there. Um, you got your deep royal active pink. Here, let's go ahead and bust this thing out. Boom. And boom. There they are. Run the jewels. Dunk low. Finally here, just in time for 420, which is Killer Mike's birthday. Check these things out. The materials on these are super, super nice. You have a total mix of like Nubuck here, uh, suede on the, uh, what do you call this? The mustache? We'll call it the mustache today. And then you even have some leather up here on the collar and on the back of the heel um, you have your your pink check and what looks to be new buck but it just feels super nice good to the touch um, and then some of the details that you want to um, just kind of go over and over and over again this one is made for skateboarding so you will see this turn and stitch toe cap on this dunk low and what that is the turn and stitch toe cap I say it till I'm blue in the face. There's been a lot of blue shoes, um, and I'm often blue in the face talking about these blue shoes. But anyway, this uh, this toe construction just helps the shoe last longer and hold up to skateboarding. Um, you do have your Ollie protection here, right there. Um, I tried to turn the product preview off on this one, but I still think it's focusing okay. But there's your Ollie protection on this guy right there. Um, Toe box looks pretty good. Check it out. Nice looking materials on that thing. And uh, these shoes look awesome. One more thing that I like about this shoe is the clear outsole. You got it right here. But not only can you read this Run the Jewels print that's repeated all over, the clear to me grips better as a skate shoe. So I just like the clear or translucent rubber because it skates good. So yeah, I don't know if you guys have seen the same thing. I have heard that people say the same thing about basketball shoes. I don't play basketball, but I think Josh told me that for the same reason uh, people like the clear grippy soles on skate shoes, clear grippy soles are good for basketball as well. It just seems to grip a little better, which I think is pretty cool. Something different on this one, you'll notice these laces are a little bit thinner than normal. And also, you got your blue aglet on that thing. I don't know if I can show you that. But there's your blue aglet on your light blue lace. It kind of looks like a little ladder, and this is thinner than your normal um, SB oval laces. So it's kind of a little bit thinner. There is your tongue detail on this one, and this is a leather tongue. So a little bit different. Sometimes those are mesh. This is a leather one. This right here is finished at the top. Sometimes this, this little tongue label wraps over. And so you can kind of see the tongue label go over the top of the tongue. This one is more finished on the top. So that's something a little bit different. And I think that's pretty cool too. Um, there is your inside tongue tab. As I've already shown you, there is your heel. You got your gold embroidery on there so that is metallic embroidery and uh yeah i think that's it this is your slightly fatter tongue so it's not like the super super puffy tongue but it's definitely not the thin tongue on that shoe as well so um one other thing that you get in the skate dunks outside of the turn and stitch and the ollie protection here you have this uh this Phylon midsole, which just gives you a little bit more shock absorption. This Phylon comes up to about right there. And uh, yeah, that just gives you more shock absorption. Um, 
the forefront of the shoe is filled with pour on, but that is on. You can almost see through the shoe. I don't know if you can see it through there, but you can see the clearness of the sole through that lasting material. One last thing on the upper of the shoe is this, uh, these memory foam heel pods. And those just hug your Achilles and keeps your foot in place when you're skateboarding, when you're pushing around on your skateboard, your heel won't slide up and down in your shoe. So yeah, Nike SB, good stuff. Let's see here. Alrighty, there's your two, your two insoles with your, I guess your hand over fist, run the jewels logo right there. Boom, right there. Boom, you got it. And this, all this, uh, just kind of faux suede um, sock liner on that thing. So, I, this kind of feels different than than your normal sock liner. It just feels like a little more suede which I've kind of been feeling even on this material lately. It feels like the inside of the shoe just feels more like more like suede than normal. Uh, I don't know. If, I don't know if that's real or if that's just my brain. So, just saying that this feels a little different than a normal sock liner, but I might be crazy. I'm definitely crazy. Um, here you go. This is the uh, inside underneath on your Zoom Air heel pods. You have this Jamily, 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 which is Jamie, Jamie, is it Jamie? Yeah, Jamie and Emily, LP and his girlfriend's, uh, or I guess now wife's anniversary they started dating on 420 in 2010. And then this, of course, is uh, Killer Mike's birthday. So 420, 1975. Um, oh yeah, you got pour on on the forefoot here. This pour on is even more shock absorbent than the phylon throughout the midsole. So you get it right there where you get board feel, but you get some good uh, shock absorption underneath your toes. So there's that. Um, these guys run true to size and they are 130 bucks. Um, our raffle is going on right now. You'll be able to enter for both the low and the high. And if you hit on both, you can have the chance to purchase both the low and the high. That is your uh, Run the Jewels Dunk Low raffle going now. You have to come in the store to do it. And um, yeah. I think that's everything. I am in such a rush to get this done. So I'm going to knock it out right now. We're done. Thank you guys for watching. Video for the high is coming up super soon um, tomorrow. Hopefully this one goes up tonight. I'm trying to wrap these things up really quick. Thank you guys for being patient. Listen to all the tape in the background. It's crazy. I'm just taping up boxes. Anyway, that, that's it, guys. All the best. Love blue tile. And, uh, we will see you in the next one. Right? Right. That's right. Goodbye. Actually, one last thing before I go. These come with extra laces. You have this dark blue and you have this light blue. Kind of matches the shoes remarkably, isn't that? You got your uh, light blue aglets on this one and you got light blue aglets on this one as well. So, huh, yeah, there you go. That's it. Goodbye.